The annual budget for the United States government is one step closer to getting approved. Part of the nearly $1.4 trillion budget includes border security. And Channel 5's Kristen Colon in our studio with a closer look on what the spending bill means for the Valley. After the House of Representatives voted to pass the budget today, we spoke with local Congressman Henry Cuellar. The 2020 spending bill will address more border security issues, such as the lack of agents and various border wall projects. The House avoiding a holiday shutdown by voting on a spending bill, proposing millions for border security initiatives. One person partaking in that vote, local Congressman Henry Cuellar, who also added specific language regarding immigration issues. We were able to add $101 million more than last year to the uh, Executive Office for Immigration Review. That's basically where they hire immigration judges. We're supposed to go up to 100 new immigration judges, uh, including staff. Uh, so that will provide uh, the backlog, as you know, we're over a million cases in backlog. That backlog increasing because of the Migrant Protection Protocol Program. Another area Cuellar says they plan on allocating money. Also, more than $100 million for Customs and Border Protection officers. Cuellar says they need to hire more personnel for the ports of entry, specifically agriculture specialists, so that trade won't slow down. Also, around $13 million for Border Patrol to hire people known as processing coordinators. They should be trained in emergency, medical, mental health, migrant legal rights, traffic and victim protection authorization, how to identify child abuse and neglect, and of course, all that will be reported back to our, uh, uh, to our committee also. Other areas the spending bill focuses on, lands the border wall might go through, such as the Eli Jackson Cemetery and Chapel, that Cuellar now says will be protected. The issues on the historic cemeteries, I, this is the sixth protection I've added, which means no fencing in the historic cemeteries, which means that Jackson uh, Cemetery. In terms of other areas where the wall might impact Cuellar, as the bill does not mention specific counties in the valley compared to other years. Instead, Homeland Security will base everything off what they see as priority areas to build. This spending bill was passed by the House and is now in the hands of the Senate. Eventually, it will be up to the president to approve or deny. In the studio, Christian Colon, Channel 5 News at 6.